Mario Tom, Spazzy coming right at you. 500,000 subscribers. That's too much. I can't anymore. It's I, I can't slap myself. I've been releasing three videos a week for a long time. The channel has been active since November 1st, 2011. And whether you're being a new little fart that bumped into me through the community spotlight, or if you've been here from the start, I thought you might enjoy a little trip down memory lane where I point out some of the videos that I thought was a little bit special or might be a key component of what took us to this joyous occasion of half a million subscribers. Let's go. And what better way to start off with the first video I ever released on this channel. Spaz is here, 1st November 2011. And this video demonstrates how little of a clue I had of what I was supposed to do or where I wanted to go. I think it got like 14 views. Most of them were my friends. And it just goes to show that you have to start somewhere. And what I ended up doing on the channel turned out to be something completely different. And I love that. Let's unleash the horn. So what you do is basically you build your defense. Uh, I'm not gonna build there, sorry. And uh, you have to defend against the hordes of orcs that come through the door. And of course we'll have to look at the video that spawned the entire epic moment series, which is the most viewed and biggest one on my channel. It was uploaded on the 2nd December 2011, and the title might be number 2, and that's because when I did upload them, I named them something else, and when I decided to make it into a series, I went back and changed the title. And I guess at that point I just felt like this was better as number 2, I don't know, but it's it's actually the first one ever uploaded, officially. It's called Epic Moments Number 2, No I Might Die, and it's a very short clip of me being so fed that it doesn't matter that I derp. Ooh, you want time, you want no, I might die. No. Oh, come on. Oh, die. Oh. This is the point where I also decided to throw my little creative mind into something new, and I made a song of some sort. It was called "I Love AD Carries," and it was an a cappella tune about playing AD Carries. Pretty smart. But of course, there's tons of champions in this league But most of them just aren't good enough for me They fiddle with magic and burst and CCs But to me, there's only one type, and that's AD Now this is an important video for the channel Because number one, they used it in the Summoner's Showcase Which was a series that Rito Games were running on their, their official YouTube channel And that brought it to a mind-boggling view count of around 25,000 at that point But number two, it also set a little notion in me that I can do a lot of weird stuff I mean, that video spawned the Double Step a cappella video, a stupid vid that got showed on the Riot Games Facebook page. And that can be tied to some more recent videos, like the Honorable Badge song that I did, was it a month ago or something? You can call me Invulnerable Spaz, and I've got that Honorable Badge. Stepping up to Solo Baron Nash, cause I'm beef like a bro without stash. And quality-wise, you can totally see that there's been some progress there, and that makes me really happy. And I hope you guys can recognize that as well. And then there's the first LOL Cypher, which I was a small channel at that point I'd never get called out but what I decided to do was sort of like create a little one anyways and then sort of squeeze in there like can I be a part of this piece maybe and as it turns out a lot of people enjoyed it right now I think it has a considerable amount of use but most importantly by doing it I got in touch with some of the other League of Legends content creators out there which was really cool and that's why it's an important video let's shift it up to something more manly Terrier. Cause he's one of the best And he's got a muscular chest From the north to the south to the east to the west Wherever you are, you will get blessed this is the first meetup video I ever did. It's when I went to DreamHack for the first time. Now, as a video, it's probably not important for the channel, but for me personally, and I guess professionally, I hold it very dearly because this was the first time I went outside and I met people in real life who cared about my stupid channel. I don't know. That little tingling sensation of knowing that people care, I still bring that with me and I think it affects what I do as a whole. And of course, the legendary AD carry had to be in here. It's probably one of the more ambitious projects I did with Vudvu Sela. You guys know Vudvu Sela. He's the one who's done the Archer song. He's really talented. This video, I, I hate the song because I've listened to it so many times. But I'm really proud of it and you guys enjoyed it. And I definitely want to try and do more of this in the future. Playing with the ports and they will protect us. It comes to teleport, but it won't deflect us. Your life cut short when the hook connects us. Announce the reports that are broken your nexus. Ooh, milestone. This is the first lip sync video I did from the LCS broadcasts. I know I have plenty of subscribers who only care about these types of videos and that's perfectly fine they do take some time to create though and i do have more coming up don't worry about that guys this was the first one i did got noticed by all the casters and stuff and it was really cool and i just enjoy the crap out of making it and you guys seem to enjoy watching it so a special video indeed 
let's click this. Boop! Welcome to lesson two in advanced paint in League of Legends. Freak was here last week. Uh, I'm here now, so we've upped the quality. Uh, so I'm just gonna go ahead and... Uh, no! Oh, wow. That, that looks pretty good, that. The 23rd of October 2013, about two years after I started the channel, I released a video called Spazzy Vlogs All In. The video, much like the meetups, not so important, but this was the point where I quit my education of becoming a radio producer, moved back to Stockholm, where I'm from, and went, as the title suggests, all in to the art of making YouTube videos. Art, I don't know about that. Everything made sense. I'm not a quitter. Usually I wanted to finish what I start, but it had gotten to the point where friends and family were saying, I think you're pretty stupid if you don't go and do this now. So I did. So far, I have no regrets. I have the best job in the world. I would cut my wrist and bleed out a perfectly fun and entertaining videos if I could. I don't know why I talk like this. Now, I've made a lot of epic moments. I can't even remember them all. They've evolved into being sort of like a five minute or so episode of mostly us having fun and being stupid. The hashtag CTDM is still what we use to like talk within, you know, the community. It means crisp to the maximum. That's the title of the episode. It's number 91 and it's also the most viewed of the whole series. Oh, and also TV. Show it up one time. Give it up two times, you know. Grandpa, my friend, your brethren, what you doing? I'm a farmer in my jungle, mon. Crisp to the maximum. All right, friends, the last video I want to showcase is, of course, the most viewed video on the channel. This very week, it was also my first video to ever reach one million views. That's insane, by the way. You can't, a mil you can't have a million views. I don't, I don't know. I can't. I most frequently asked question would be, is there more? Are you making a second one? Well, as a matter of fact, I am. And my goal is to make it not as good as the first one. I, I guess I'll try. But it takes some time. Stay tuned, friends. There's not much else to be said. Here it is. Like, this girl was all over me. Like, me. <laughs> like, me. Raise your doggers. And that's all there is to it. Now, I couldn't include all the videos. Because I've released, like, more than 420. 4, 420! That's right. So I'm sure you guys have a favorite or something that you think should have been included in the video. And as it happens, I want to know about it. Maybe there will be like a hipster spoozy watcher. Oh, well, I don't really like the mainstream Chris to the maximum. I, I sort of prefer the more underappreciated art. I should stop. So if you do, let me know in the comment box below. And of course, thank you for letting me have the most amazing job, friends. It's all thanks to you. I can never stop reading your comments and messages. I'm so happy about that you guys care. And as long as you do... I will keep going. Here's to 500,000 more. Now join me in an epic duets as we move onwards to new greatness. Either way, this has been Spazzy and Planty. And we're both out. <laughs>